tattoo tattoo. Getting your tattoo back. Here it is. Ooh. 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 Eats is here. Hello. Hi. Go take yeah, yeah. Adeline. <laughs> thank you so much. Here you go. You can keep keep the change. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And Have good. a good one. Thank yeah. you. Ta-da! The food is here. But good. It's not even good morning. It's good afternoon. We slept in so late tonight. All of us feel like. Sh but today I think I'm gonna get a tattoo. We're at this new villa, it's in Chenggu, which honestly I really like the location. I just feel like it's more central and there's more things to do around here. There's, we literally just walked to our coffee shop today, but I wanted to get udon. <laughs> so this is everything that I got. This total was I think like 300,000, which is, how much is that? It was like 20 US dollars for everything, but I got four water bottles. We got edamame and then two chicken udons. Oh, I'm so excited. I've been like craving udon all day. This is exactly what I was craving this morning. Oh my god. But I have a tattoo appointment at 4 and it's 3.41 right now. It takes about like 10 minutes to walk there, so I'll we'll probably leave soon. 10 minute walk away. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh, I'm so tired. <gasps> you made it. I was looking up on TikTok. Everyone loves this spot. It's called Tattoo Tattoo. I found the exact guy that I want to do my tattoo. Woo! Look at the mermaids. Okay, I'm like gonna. Whoa. Hi. Hi. So, I'm getting a tattoo on my back. It's gonna be down the spine, which I'm kind of scared. I think that's gonna hurt, but... This is the before. Nothing. I have nothing on my back. Look at this. Tattoo pain map. Oh, no. <laughs> this is scary. Oh, Not it being red. I know. I'm scared. The one that hurt the most was my foot tattoo. I'm scared to see if it hurts more here. There it is. Got it. <laughs> Vibrating. All right, we're almost done. She's just doing a shading right now, but I, I feel like I went by really quick. Like I was like, I'm shocked. I when I came over here, and it was like almost done. This is the biggest tattoo yeah. of all. It's like so cute. Oh, guys, it's so cute. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you. finished we're leaving right now we're walking 10 minutes back to the airbnb they gave me this to clean it so i'm gonna put it in my bags and to the 10 minute walk yeah. Yeah. i'm trying to convince jake and brianna to get a tattoo tomorrow to be continued <laughs> i realized i never ended today's vlog my tattoo actually is healing pretty well this is like i'm back in canada already as you could tell but this is what it looks like i showed my mom and she actually really liked it and same with like my family i was a little bit scared about what my family these reactions are gonna be because it's my biggest tattoo that I've ever gotten but they actually really liked it my mom was like oh it's really cute that it says Mahokita and that it's Tagalog and I was surprised she actually really liked it even my dad he actually he's like oh that's actually really nice I think he was scared I was gonna get like <laughs> a super big tattoo or something like that but I don't know what do you guys think a lot of you guys I posted on my um Instagram that I got my tattoo and a lot of you guys were like how was the pain okay so I thought the pain I thought would be a lot worse because honestly the worst tattoo I've ever gotten was underneath my foot. I remember that felt like stepping on Legos like over and over and over again. It hurt so bad. That one was my most painful tattoo. So this one was all red on the diagram saying that this one hurts the most on the spine. But honestly, nothing really compares to the bottom of the foot. That one hurts so bad. Although it did kind of hurt. It kind of felt like scratching on your back, but it's kind of nice. <laughs> but it was kind of annoying. You could feel it like all throughout your spine. But tattoos are different for every single person. And also people were asking how much it costs. I think it was around 200 or 300 dollars us oh, i forget how much it was but i think for a big piece like that i think it's not so bad but i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog today's merch shout out of the day goes to polish scarlet on instagram she's wearing her i don't chase i attract merch she looks so cute what belongs to me will simply find me which new merch is coming i hope you guys are excited i kind of like featured it a little bit in the vlog
vlogs. It's like a new revamped yellow girl supporting girls, which I'm kind of excited about. For especially for summer, I think it'll be super cute. And then today's tip of the day goes to Kennedy Pog on Instagram. You just tag me. That's how you become merch shot of the day or tip of the day. Her tip of the day says it's okay to fall apart even if you thought you had it all under control. You are not weak. Honestly, nobody has it all under control. I'm pretty sure Ariana Grande has even talked about this. She's like, I don't even know what I'm doing in my life. If Ariana Grande has no idea what she's doing with her life, you are totally okay not being in control and knowing exactly what you're doing with your life. It's so normal to change your mind and change your ideas and change and grow and not be able to predict the future. It's scary, but it's kind of like beautiful if you think about it. Like you can't predict what you're gonna be like in five years and you can't predict, you know, when you're gonna get married with the dream job you're gonna have, blah, 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 blah. Like maybe you'll change your mind and you, instead of being a crazy scientist, you're like a ballerina. I don't know. <laughs> Follow what makes you happy. I love you guys and I'll see you guys in my next daily vlog tomorrow. Same place, same time. Bye.